Greetings comrades and welcome to the new video. Today will be a fairly shorter video than I anticipated but again I'll show you a very nice thing for breakfast. This is maybe one of my favorite breakfast as a child and maybe one of the quickest breakfast to prepare. I remember when I was uh, small, I uh, before school, like we started school really early, like uh, 7 in the morning. So essentially you have to get up at 6 and yeah, maybe wash your teeth, prepare yourself for school, I don't know and while I was preparing myself for school my grandpa was always preparing some breakfast during I was washing my teeth in a room or a two uh, near the kitchen and while I was washing my teeth I always smelled uh, this very nice baked bread with some cheese and stuff and I got really really hungry and I ate like one to two or maybe sometimes three slices of bread which my grandpa prepared like the recipe you see and this is a thing that to this day I prepare on a weekly basis maybe one or two times and not only for breakfast I uh, rarely have a regular breakfast because of my schedule but uh, maybe for lunch or for dinner I prepare it like one or two times a week and it's one of my favorite things to be honest as a quick thing to prepare it's called a princess I'm not sure why I mean it's totally not a Disney princess I mean if they if they buy the rights to these sandwiches I'm out of this world I don't want to live on this planet anymore but all jokes aside it's a very nice sandwich and by sandwich I mean I'm not sure how you call them because you most westerners call sandwiches think that's uh, with two slices of bread on with some things on the middle but this is our like grilled sandwiches in the oven so without a second slice of bread on top you just prepare some mixture of bulgarian white cheese or maybe if you don't have cheese some isvara or cottage cheese uh, with some eggs uh, if you're extra fancy or you can afford it have some nice cheese like a melting cheese maybe kashkaval maybe adam maybe cheddar whatever you enjoy the cheddar goes perfect because it has this sharp taste uh, grate some cheese in the mixture uh, butter your bread spread on top and eat the perfect breakfast like you bake it for 15 minutes prepare some iran on the side or some compote and you're good to go maybe for 20 minutes you can prepare a huge amount of sandwiches for the whole family and let me know if you like these sandwiches if you prepare such kind of sandwiches where you live or maybe other variety of sandwich I'm not sure I'm not sure how to describe it also so I'll just call it a Slavic grilled cheese or something like that with that said let's see how the sandwiches are prepared the recipe is very fast easy and in the same time it doesn't lack any taste at all Time to prepare some princess sandwiches comrades which are maybe my favorite sandwiches to be honest. Uh, here I have around 100 grams regular cheese like Bulgarian white cheese and on top I'll add some cottage cheese around 100 grams again. The cottage cheese I add for some more additional protein and the other cheese is because it's cheese it's awesome it has the, all the taste in the world. On top of the cheese mixture I will add some egg. You can double or triple this recipe. I prepare uh, only one batch for me because I was very very hungry and this is not very typical but I like to do it. I add some pepper and, and salt on top and some grated kashkaval or cheddar cheese or Adam cheese, whatever cheese you enjoy to be honest you can add. I imagine some parmigiano or pecorino would be awesome here. So if you have these available, try them. I don't have these cheeses available here on a price that is affordable to be honest. And this is how the cheese mixture should look like. Make sure to eat some kashkaval in the process. And to prepare the bread, I have some whole grain bread, which is cut like for a toaster. This is an optional step. A lot of Bulgarians don't do it. And I call these people traitors because they don't butter their bread before baking. And if you don't want to be so calorie dense or heavy, you can add some uh, low fat cream cheese instead of the butter. Make sure to split very well the mixture on top of the slices of bread so you cannot have excess mixture. If you have excess mixture just pour it near the bread and bake it. It would become something like a cheese patty like that. You see? Uh, just spray it a little bit and it would become tasty. Bake them around 20 minutes on 200 degrees Celsius. If you have a fan in the oven turn it on and you should aim for the slices of bread to be like golden brown like this. On the side I had some other sandwiches which were not for me. They were with ham and with some cheese 
And this is how our princess sandwiches should look like. I'm not sure why they, we call them princess. I'm not sure if any princess eats sandwiches like that. But this is how we call them. And this is a very traditional breakfast for us in Bulgaria. And every Slav kid basically, every Bulgarian kid knows it and enjoys it. I enjoyed it for lunch this time with some dry tarator on the side, but it was it was awesome to be to be honest. A Slav difficulty level, one out of five. I mean these are sandwiches, nothing complicated here. And with that said, the video was quite short today, but I hope you still enjoyed it and still got some ideas to prepare, like easy ideas to prepare for you and your family. This was from me for today, comrades, and I'll slav you next time. <laughs>